Aren't you that Gundam first-person shooter famous guy that I've been hearing about? <laughs> Everybody's talking about you here. Yeah, no, uh, it's uh, it's a lot of fun, and uh, we're showing off our, our product here, the Darby Vision Darblet. And, uh, Darby Vision Darblin. Yep, and uh, also the new product, the Darby Vision Cobalt. And what we do is we enhance all images. Uh, any digital image we can process in such a way that it adds depth, uh, sharpness, clarity and uh, detail to the image regardless of the fidelity. So you use this as an add-on for your graphics card or for people that can't afford a high-end graphics card? Uh, uh, get the best graphics card you can even if you don't have a great graphics card will still pop the image and uh, it's great for consoles, great for computer gaming. I do like I said like you said I do a lot of first-person shooter and uh, a lot of the a lot of times you find people who just run past somebody who's crouched against a wall because they blend in with the wall. Well, when you add the depth back into the image, you can see them uh, crouching there and you don't pass up on those easy kills. Uh, if you like RPGs like Assassin's Creed and uh, you do a lot of climbing and parkour type of games and uh, you have trouble finding the handholds, when you pop the image, those uh, handholds just come right out and it's very easy to go and navigate through the game. Cool. Sounds very interesting. And this is a comparison shot of the two before and after? It is. It is. As the bar goes to the right, on the left-hand side, there's the popped image. As it goes to the left, that's the original uh, uh, Xbox 360 image. And you can see there's quite a dramatic difference. Uh, there's three modes. This is a uh, high def. It's the most refined version. There's also gaming, which has a bit more pop. And then full pop, which is the... Uh, uh, most aggressive form of the processing. And I'll just do a quick A-B here. Off, so, on. Would you use it for a regular, uh, like, DVDs? Oh, you can use it with your Blu-ray system. You can use it on DVDs. Uh, if you watch uh, YouTube or you stream Netflix, this works with anything that has an HDMI cable. Uh, even my video card, it has a DVI out. Where I just use an adapter, put the HDMI in, and you're good to go. That sounds very interesting. How does it, how does it work? Uh, what we do is, as the image comes in, we uh, mathematically create a left and right image, and we then defocus and subtract out of that the depth information and smuggle it back into the uh, 2D image. So what we're doing is we're adapting the image to the way your human visual system works by doing uh, a form of uh, brain processing in silicon. Sounds pretty cool. M13 for Asia News.